the United States State Department approved a potential massive foreign military sale to the Republic of Turkey for F-16 aircraft acquisition and modernization, along with related equipment, at an estimated cost of $23.0 billion. Turkey has formally requested to purchase 40 new F-16 aircraft and to upgrade 79 existing F-16 aircraft to the more advanced V configuration. The request encompasses a range of critical components, including 32 F-16C Block 70 aircraft and 8 F-16D Block 70 aircraft, along with various essential systems and equipment. The proposed package includes 48 F-110GE 129D engines, with 40 to be installed and 8 held as spares. Additionally, it features 149 improved programmable display generators, distributed as 40 for installation, 10 as spares, and 99 for the modernization program, where 79 will be installed and 20 kept as spares. IPDG's enhanced cockpit displays, aiding pilots in monitoring and controlling the aircraft's systems, targeting, and navigation. To improve the F-16's radar capabilities for target detection and tracking, 149 and APG-83 active electronically scanned array scalable agile beam radars are included, with 40 for installation, 10 as spares, and 99 for the modernization program, where 79 will be installed and 20 held as spares. Playing a central role in processing data and ensuring efficient communication between various onboard systems, 169 units of modular mission computers, of which 40 will be installed, 10 reserved as spares, and 119 assigned to the modernization program. The package also contains 159 embedded global positioning system inertial navigation systems, which provide precise navigation and targeting capabilities, each equipped with either a selective availability anti-spoofing module or a M-code capability and precise positioning service. Specifically, 40 will be installed, 8 will serve as spares, and 111 will support the modernization program. Additionally, 168 Integrated Viper Electronic Warfare Suite or equivalent electronic warfare systems will be provided, with 40 for installation, 10 as spares, and 118 assigned to the modernization program. These systems will enhance electronic warfare capabilities, including the detection and jamming of enemy radar and communication signals. The armament and munitions included in the sale are extensive, comprising 858 LEU-129 guided missile launchers, to enable the F-16 to carry and launch various air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles, 44 M-61 Vulcan cannons, to offer close-range air-to-air and ground attack capabilities, and 16 and AAQ-33 sniper advanced targeting pods, to provide advanced target tracking and reconnaissance capabilities. To facilitate secure and efficient communication between aircraft and ground stations, enhancing coordination and situational awareness, the package also includes 151 Multifunctional Information Distribution System Joint Tactical Radio Systems, 40 for installation and 4 ground terminals, 8 as spares, and 99 for the modernization program. In terms of armament, the sale incorporates 952 advanced medium-range air-to-air missiles AIM-120C8 or equivalent missiles, along with 96 advanced medium-range air-to-air missiles guidance sections. Additionally, 864 GBU-39 B small diameter bombs increment 1 are included, as well as 2 GBU-39 guided test vehicles and 2 GBU-39 practice bombs.
The package encompasses 96 AGM 88B high speed anti radiation missiles and 96 AGM 8080 advanced anti radiation guided missiles, along with 10 advanced anti radiation guided missiles, captive air training missiles, 11 advanced anti radiation guided missiles control sections, and 12 advanced anti radiation guided missiles guidance sections. Air-to-air -air missile capabilities are further augmented by 401 AIM 9X Block II Sidewinder missiles, 12 AIM 9X Block II Sidewinder captive air training missiles, 40 AIM 9X Block II Sidewinder tactical guidance units, and 12 AIM 9X Block II Sidewinder captive air training missiles guidance units. Additional munitions include 1282 Malawi and Quacha's inert-filled general-purpose bombs, 850 Joint Direct Attack Munition KMU-556 Tail Kits for GBU-31, 200 Joint Direct Attack Munition KMU-557 Tail Kits for GBU-31 V3, 384 Joint Direct Attack Munition KMU-559 Tail Kits for GBU-32, and 3 Joint Direct Attack Munition KMU-572 Tail Kits for GBU-38 or Laser Joint Direct Attack Munition GBU-54. Finally, the package also features a wide range of additional equipment and support services, including training missiles, cryptographic devices, software, publications, logistics support, engineering services, and support equipment to maintain, repair, and sustain the Turkish F-16 fleet over its operational lifespan.